up, YouTube? What to you know? My name is Domino with Zero. Welcome to episode 9 of our Pokemon Ultra Sun Wonderlock. Last time, we made our way from Mele Mele Island here to Akala Island and honestly interacted with a bunch of irrelevant characters. In today's episode, it is sunny outside again. It's actually a perfect weather day. I mean, perfect weather. Not quite summer vacation weather, but literal perfect weather. And we're here, we're going to be making our way towards our next trial site with our unstoppable team. Yes, I said unstoppable team. If you're enjoying our Ultra Sun Wonderlock, hit the thumbs up down below and leave me a comment. Do you think we're ever going to lose a Mon? Just let me know. Just let me know. Because I don't know if we're ever going to lose a Mon. And honestly, the titles are just going to say the same thing. Because I don't think we're ever going to lose a Pokemon. Well, let's get into it. Let's show you who we're rocking with, who our broken team is made up of. First up, we have our Japanese Snubble with Crunch, Brick Break, Lick, and Tail Whip with Intimidate, holding the Normalium Z with Serious Nature. Next up, we have our starter, the German Trumbeak with Pluck, Echo Voice, Brick Break, and Supersonic with Keen Eye, holding the Flyanium Z, Careful Nature. Then we have Muddy, our Mud Bray, uh, with Bulldoze, Double Kick, Mud Slap, and Stomp with Stamina, holding the Quick Claw. Relax nature. Then we have our Japanese pincer, the hardest hitting member of our team. Uh, that is our pincer with vice grip, brick break, revenge, focus energy with hyper cutting, holding the phytinium Z, and some good nature, jolly nature. Then we have our Japanese, I think, Trevenant with shadow claw tackle, astonish, and confuse ray with harvest. And lastly, we have our Korean wingle. With Wing Attack, Water Pulse, Echo Voice, Supersonic, with Hydration, Holding the Pretty Wing, Timid Nature, also this thing's docile, if you care about those type of things, which... Now, today, I am determined to hit a Z-move. I'm determined to hit a Z-move, and I'd prefer it to be... Snubble! Snubble! Ooh, should I... Is that a hint? Should I let Snubble lead? <clears throat> Because we all know what happens right here. And it just made a sound. I'm not sure if you could hear that, but... Hey, Domino, so glad I ran into you. So, we can see who's stronger now. I got the Z powering for my Gramps too, after making it through his grand trial. Having a battle in a place like Peniola Town feels like we're in a real old-fashioned Western showdown or something, right? This is so cool. Though, if we're real honorable cowboys, we've got to make sure our teams are healthy first. I knew... Okay, right before this episode started, I ran back and healed. I don't know why. I don't do that in this playthrough. But anyway. Alright, team. Dutrix and Pikachu and everybody, you ought to be bursting with energy after eating a pile of my mom's special pancakes. So let's show this newbie what our load has got. You call me a newbie? Oh, it's time. Oh, it's time. Oh, you might got one there. I got one here. How? You got four Pokemon? I got six. Dartrix? Alright, I knew you were starting with Dartrix. And I still led with my bug type. Alright, switch. It's level 16. He's gonna go for a flying type move. He's gonna go for a flying type move. I mean, I could just go into my. I could just go for flying EMZ. Do I remember the flying EMZ dance? Yes, I do. Should I nuke him? I'm just gonna nuke him right from the beginning. Here it goes. I wanted to do this so bad. Z power. Hit it up. There it goes. Supersonic Sky Strike. Hit it up. Hit it up. Hit it up. Bow! Eliminated. Eliminated. Gone. Get him out of here. Nintendo, please don't claim. Nintendo, please. Sent out Pikachu. Pika! I got something for Pikachu. Let's go, Muddy. Let's go, Muddy. Let's go, Muddy. Why does Mud Bray remind me of Toy Story? Can someone tell me? Does anyone know the answer to this? I did not mean to hit that. Trying to use a touchscreen without looking at said touchscreen? Difficult. Difficult. Difficile. Body. 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 I'm gonna OCO your whole team. I'm gonna OCO your entire team. Who you got up next? 
literally, this playthrough might cement me as the greatest Nuzlocke on YouTube. I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. We'll find out. Okay, this thing is, uh, what type is Noibat? I like how I just talked about being the greatest Nuzlocke, and I'm like, what type is this Pokemon? Is it just flying, or is it dragon flying? It is flying dragon. Uh, I don't have anything for, fi for, uh, for flying types. I really don't. I don't have rock, I don't have ice. I don't have anything. What you got? You got bite? Roll. You wanna see what a real bite looks like, homeboy? Here, take a look at what a real bite attack looks like. This is what a real bite looks like. What happened? Did I flinch? He used bite and flinch me. I looked away for a second, he flinched me. Here's what a real bite looks like! Yeah! I told you I was gonna crit everything. I'm not losing this game. Are you kidding me? Oh, you got your cute little Eevee here? Here, let me show you what I do to cute little Eevees. This is what I do to cute little Eevees. Why does this garage door go off right when I start recording every time? Also, we just out code every member of his team. We just out code every member of the team. Nice, how'd you come up with the battle pen like that? You gotta tell me. I like this accent. I think I finally settled in on the accent that I want to use. Meh, <clears throat> excuse me. Man, that was some kind of battle. Dartrix and everybody all took, all looked like they had a blast too. All right then, here, I'll share a bit of my good luck with you, Domino. I don't need luck. I don't need luck. I don't need luck. I don't need luck. You know, the totem Pokemon, the totem Pokemon are all like surrounded by something called a power, aura power. If you use the dire hits on your Pokemon and manage to land a critical hit, that aura won't mean a thing. You might want to try using some of those Rotom powers when you're fighting a totem too. You know, Pokemon battles are just like sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. But you're only a loser, you're only really a loser if you don't have any fun while you're at it, right? Anyway, I'm heading off at the, towards the Paniola Ranch. Alright. Yeah. I'm telling you, I, I'm feeling a little confident about our squad. I feel a little confident about our squad, and we have perhaps two Pokemon in the PC that are even better. They're even better. They're even better than this. They're even better. Um, I don't need any items, right? Let's check, let's check, let's check. Got him, got him. Oh, we're good. Oh, we're good. Oh, we're good. Oh, wait. I don't need repels. I'm really not worried about repels in this game. Because this is just a normal playthrough of this game, it's actually not a bad idea for me to just let it play. Oh, you know what? I forgot to pull a Pokemon Go. Do 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 do. Today, I was talking about this earlier, today was a perfect weather day. As in, I should be outside playing Pokemon Go. But if I don't record this now, there's no chance that it'll get up on time. So, we're gonna do this now, and I might be able to go spend some time outside tomorrow. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on. I need this before t the, the event ends this weekend. No, not that! Hold on, I need this before the event ends. Come on. Ah, oh, come on! You're gonna be shiny one of these days. I know you are. I know you will. All right, we got Pokemon Go. I need to pull it over here, don't I? I need to pull it close to me. I need to pull it close to me. All right, here we go. We're back. We're back. We're back. Meal, meal. I don't want to talk to this guy. Paniola is a small town. All right. All right. I don't want to stop there. Last episode, I mentioned this in the intro, we talked to a bunch of irrelevant people, like, not to be mean or anything, but just people that we don't need in this particular playthrough. In the first playthrough, it was people that we, you know, we got to know. <gasps> I forgot about that. Oh, look at that pincer of yours! It weighs over 110 pounds! You should watch out for this move called Grass Knot. It does more damage the heavier... Okay, are you gonna give it to me, or like what? Or like what? Hey! Talk to you. How come I can't talk to this guy? Ooh! 
Oh, well, hello there. Why don't you take a bottle with you? Happily. Can I buy 12? Can I buy 12? Come again tomorrow. Nope. All right, before we finish our last thing here, you know whose home this is, right? This is a Kiawe's home. A Kiawe's home. This is a Kiawe's home. That's why all of the Megamara are here. Now I'm just gonna howl voice all day. Now I'm just gonna howl voice literally all day. I think one of these guys gives me something. I don't remember, hold on, there's something, something. In her, oh! Oh, that would have that would have upset me so much. All right, what's this one say? The bed looks fresh and clean, but you can still detect a faint whiff of sweat. You laying in someone else's bed, smelling sweat. Are you the one that gives me the thing? A nice toasty quick ball from well somewhere. That might be the episode title. He pulled the ball from where? We'll see. I kind of want to start breaking the fourth wall a little bit. I kind of want to start uh, making some better title. Uh oh, uh oh, hold on. We got a shiny chance here. We got a shiny chance here. No. That actually, when it does focus, that actually looks really good in the camera. All right. Let's come down here. Hey now. Yo, yo, Vulpix, give me that bottle cap! Please stop! What you looking at? What's this Pokemon need a nice bottle cap for? I'm just gonna put it to better use, that's all. Nah. You there, you think you could help? Yes, of course I can help. Yes, what do you want me to do? <clears throat> You want a piece of meat? I'll show you what happens when you mess with Team Skull. Don't be, don't be whatever you stupid. Ugh. Don't be looking all dumb. Ah, come on, I'm gonna destroy you. And you know I'm gonna destroy you because I always destroy you. I always destroy these fools. Oh, oh, it's one on one. 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 One on one. All right. Only because it would take too much time. I'm just gonna go for this instead of the Z-move. Cause I would love to go for the Z-move, but honestly, we're just gonna run through this entire game with this team. I don't, I if I'm, as long as I'm smart and I don't do something stupid, we won't lose. Um, Vital throw or revenge? What does vital throw do? If this user attacks last in turn, this throw move never misses. User attacks last. And this one is if the user attacks last, it does twice as much. So that would mean revenge is better. Right? Especially if I'm going against someone I know outspeeds me. Come on, what you got? Oh, I forgot when I, when I do that. It's all your fault, just because you wouldn't hand over that bottle cap. That's right, I'm gonna stand in between them. Let's say, get out the way, bro. Yo, you got lucky, Vulpix. Don't count on people to help you next time. Ah. Come over here. I'm going to put the Z-ring through your face. Hey, I know what you thought I was going to say. Oh, thank goodness. Everything's going to be all right now. Yeah, I know, Vulpix. Woo! Oh, dear. What's wrong? Yeah, exactly. It'd make this old lady happy if you'd come back tomorrow, too. Uh, highly unlikely that I remember. <gasps> Wait a minute! There's a lady that's right... Who are you waving at? Everyone who works in the ranch loves a good Pokemon battle. This lady. Now, not gonna let this happen. Uh, oh. I can just do this. Oh wait, no, I don't have any grass type moves. Um then let's just do this. I should be good. But she's she she doesn't play around. She's for real. 
This this woman right here is for real. I can remember this. She's about to send out her carving in this luxury ball, and it's gonna hurt. Or maybe it's a Sableye. Carving, yep. I think I would have preferred it to be Sableye, but this carving's defense is so high. It's so stinking high. Alright, it's only level 15. I'm telling you, dude. But that did nothing. Rock throw. Hold on. We'll be alright. We'll be alright. Get this intimidate off. Oh, you have clear body. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, you have clear body. You have clear body. You have clear body. <clears throat> it's time. Oh, I'm holding Normalium Z and all I have is Tail Whip! <laughs> what a disappointment. Alright, I'm gonna go for a quick break. Let's just see how much it does. Oh, no, no, no. Stop it. <clears throat> Hold on, let me take a quick second and super potion you. Because now if we can get off a... I'm going to brick break again. You outspeed me? Oh, no, this is stupid if... Hold on, this is really stupid if you, if she winds up healing. Because then I just wind up in the same place. Yeah, full restore. Exactly. Exactly. Alright, so we're back at zero. We're back at zero, zero. I like that this is a challenge, though. Thank you for making me think. I could go for crunch, but crunch... No, because crunch is four times resisted. Sharpen? That doesn't raise your attack, does it? Okay. Hmm. See, I... Rock throw? Rock throw's not gonna do a whole lot to me. In fact, it's resisted. But it is plus one. Okay, cool. Perfect, 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 perfect. I'm a confused Ray. Perfect, 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 perfect. All right. Now, I should go for... I should go for some, uh... I'm gonna try and flinch you. While you're confused. Oh, oh, hold on. Pause, pause, pause. Here it is. It is time. Is this the same one? I clicked it. You even registered that I clicked it. Can I click anything else? Okay, the app died. <laughs> hold on. Reloading the app. Okay. This, this strategy's working so far. We've got two flinches in a row. Confused. Sharpen. That's fine. Sharpen all you want. Sharpen all you want. Okay. Real quick. I'm gonna go ahead and catch this if it's... If it's not the one. Alright. It might be the same one. There's a, there's a, it is the same one. A tiny little gnat flying around me, which is annoying the crap out of me. Alright, uh, let's go for more Astonish. <clears throat> Snap that of confusion and use Smackdown. Got a crit, okay. If that was a crit, then we're gonna win, it's just gonna take us a second, so hold on. Also, if this thing would've used Smackdown against my Wingle, we might not still be here. I might not be so happy. Alright, I'm a Shadow Claw, because Shadow Claw does more. 
Perfect. One more shadow. Yes. All right. She was a little stronger. No, she was actually exactly what I said she was going to be when we walked up. I said she was going to be difficult. And that she was. She most certainly was difficult. Once learned faint attack, sure. Um. I feel like Astonish is good. I'm actually going to get rid of Tackle. That'll work. Because the only reason I would ever use Tackle would be against a normal type. And I can just use Faint Attack anyway. And Faint Attack is better. Want to learn Headbutt? Sure. Set a Tail Whip. Yeah, let's do it. I like it. And now Normalium Z will actually do something. <laughs> what Normal? What? I don't think there is a Z move that I could have. She's strong. All right. Because of the PP, I need to go back. And then we're going to make our way all the way through Paniola. The rest of these guys are going to be pushovers. I'll probably let our... Uh... I'm probably going to let Wingle carry us through. When does, Pel when does Wingle evolve? I know, I, I think I looked this up earlier in the playthrough. I think I looked this up earlier in our playthrough. Level 25, okay. Okay, so we're, yeah, we're gonna let Wingle lead. Everyone's level 18, 19. We're just having a walk through the park right now. It's literally just a walk through the park. Where's the challenge? Oh, we can get an encounter here. Paniola Ranch. I didn't even think about it. Oh, well, can't do it just yet. Oh, you got, uh, oh, you gotta be a tri, uh, hey now, you gotta be a trial goer, right? Well, you got a good sense of timing. The captain's actually here now, so come on. I had to, I had to tune in my Texan, which shouldn't be hard for me to tune in. <laughs> me, me, take me, 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 take. me, 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 Like, hi, thanks for stopping by. The Moo Moo Milk from Paniola Ranch is the best. It's so rich and creamy when you use it in it in white sauce and other things. Mmm, the taste can't even be described. Oh, by the way, since I was lucky enough to run into you here, I'll do you a little favor. Stoutland, okay, give me these items. See, Stoutland, see, Stoutland can sniff out items that are uh, for you that are buried in the dirt while you can't even see them. When you're riding Stalin, press B to... Okay. Get up there and try it. There's all kinds of stuff flying around waiting for you to find it. And Stalin will bark louder and louder with the closer it gets to some item buried in the ground. If you go all the way down to Route 5, you'll come out on Brooklyn Hill. My friend Lana is up there. So say hi to your, her if you see her. That was actually super... Like, there was nothing. There was nothing there. Uh, if I re yeah, if I remember right, when you come back, there's a nice little... You're the one with the attitude, right? Yeah, you're the one with the attitude. I don't know why you got this little attitude. I wouldn't tease that one. If you do, he'll buck and kick you. Tauros are generally known as spirited Pokemon, but this fellow is pretty feisty even for Tauros. But I guess it's not that surprising considering how new he is to the ranch. I'd like him to train to become a rad Pokemon, but I can't even put him through his paces if he bucks at every little thing like this. I guess we'll need the mistress's skill for this one. Is that you? Me? Ridiculous! Haha! <laughs> you think the mistress is some weak little girl? Right then, it's time we're called a mistress. A mistress. Yup. Here she is, the mistress of the ranch. Ranch, meal tank. Me, 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 tank, me. One roar for meal tank, and even the uh, and even the most onerous is instantly as quiet as a little lit. Well, they do say the stronger the Taurus is, the harder it is to control. Looks like even the mistress is having a, tr a tough time with this one. 
Maybe if he burns off a bit of excess energy, he'll be able. It'll be a little easier to bring him to heal. What do you think? How about taking on Doros in a battle? Then don't hold back. Go all out against this one. All right, I will. You want? Oh, you want me to go all out? Or when you say all out, do you mean all out? Cause I can go all out. I wasn't going to go all out. I was just going to go part of the way out. But if you want me to go all out. If this, thing's winds up, if this thing winds up killing me somehow. Rage. You want me to go all out? I would activate. I'm telling you, if I get a Mimikyu and we get Mimikyu EMZ, we're gonna be gold. We're gonna be golden here. Bow! Whoa! Gone! How you like that, Tauros? Now shut up and listen. I'm trying to tell you something. Hey, let me tell you something. All these Pokemon are still here. All the same Pokemon. Looks like you worked up a fine sweat. I think Taurus feels pretty satisfied too. Even Tauros couldn't stand up to the combined powers of the pair of you and Mill Tank. Thanks, sweetie. Just what we expect from the Rance's mistress. Thanks to you, I think we can finally start on this fella's ride Pokemon training. So I hope you take this scope lens from me, give it to a Pokemon to hold in its moves more than likely to land critical hits. Hits. With ride Pokemon, even people who aren't Pokemon trainers can enjoy a convenient life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get me out of here. All right, now back to what we were doing. Oh, I can run into an encounter out here. Dang, Pinsir literally took one rage. He took a rage. That's it. He just took a rage. And that's nothing. Are you raising Pokemon? I show Ooh, we got a shiny chance. I put the Everything disappeared. Jerks! Ugh. Why the game act like a that? I'm telling you, now I'm gonna be stuck in these freaking voices all day. Alright, here we go. Let's try that again. Try Wait, what was over there? Oddish? Damn. Oh, sad day. I can't wait till we get a shiny in our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee playthrough. Two years in a row getting, sh getting shinies on. In our playthrough. That's actually pretty crazy that that didn't kill. I'm just gonna go for another one. We good, we good, we good, we, we, we good. Can we really run through this game without losing a single Pokemon? There's no way. There's no way. Right? Want to learn quick attack? Sure. Ooh, echoed voice supersonic. I'm gonna have to pass on quick attack. Quick attack ain't that exciting. Especially not when our team is already, like, overpowered. <laughs> our team is already a little wild. There's an item right here. Got some Paralyzer Heal. Now, I know I could have jumped on Stoutland and found a bunch of hidden items, but there's nothing really exciting. Hey, look! It's our version of Mud Bray. Or our version of Muddy. I'm going to go for a uh, Wing Attack. Perfect. Nice. Oh, and all you got is ground type moves. That's right. You don't even get double kick until level like 14 or 15. No, I forgot. Okay, that's fine. Because I have a. Uh, I can kill them. Ooh, what if we get a shiny during the sh during the episode? Wouldn't that be nice? I think that'd be super nice. Oh no, not mud sport. Oh no. 
Alright, take him out. If we get a shiny by SOS Encounter. I mean, obviously we're going to use it. Just because that's cool. It's, it's super cool to get a shiny. Like, you know, some people talk about the shiny claws and they're like, that's a weak clause. You know, real Nuzlockers shouldn't care about that. Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, it's the chance to get a free new Pokemon. What's the problem? What's the issue? Yes, give a nickname to Mudbray. His name will simply be... Wonder Domino! Yeah. Send to a box. And then we gonna keep on pushing for now. For now. Wait a second. Again, I could get on Stoutland and I could find all the hidden items. But instead... I'm a Pokemon nurse lady. I help take care of Pokemon trains like you. For some reason, I see Pokemon holding eggs. Mysterious, isn't it? If you want to take care of your Pokemon, please seek to assist her in the building. But do you have a free egg for me? Apparently you can leave Pokemon there and they rage Pokemon. We got nurseries, but all we do is hold Pokemon for you. We don't help them get stronger or learn moves, but I guess we're easier on the wallet. Oh, if you leave two Pokemon together, the nurse might find out an egg. It, it, uh, since we're talking about it, do you want one of the eggs I found here at the nursery recently? Yeah, yes, please. Add the egg to my party. We're gonna put away... Uh, I mean, I could just run the egg out. I'm gonna send to box as is. I could just run this egg until it's... No, shut up! Oh, snap! Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna... We're definitely gonna go hatch this egg real quick. Ooh, we got hidden power! I'm definitely going to teach that to zero Pokemon in my box. I don't want to know anything. Leave me alone. Right. Rhyme! Yep, yep, yep. Eevee, Eevee. Okay, sure. Sure, Eevee. Speaking of Eevee. Alright, here we go. This is the ultimate strategy. I definitely have done this more than I care to admit. Certainly not as much, because I used to shiny hunt. We did some shiny hunting streams back in the day. We got some shiny reactions on the channel. Um, but yeah, just doing this little circle here. Has, has shiny hunting in this game changed? Or is it still the same? I think it's still the same. I don't think there's like a more... Uh, I don't think there's a more optimized way, a more effective way of hatching eggs than just doing this. It used to be that you would go back and forth between these two people up here, but that just, to me at least, because you have to do something like, uh, you have to go like this. And, and like, if you don't do it right, you know what I mean? But then I guess you'd be... I don't know. I, I hate that. I don't I don't like that way. That way sucks. I do it this way. Twirl around in a circle. But let's go ahead and get this done. And then we'll be able to maybe do one more little story. Oh! We're going to do some trades. And then we'll see. I don't want to make any calls on if we're going to do any storyline stuff right now. Because there is a storyline thing to, to be done. Um, but... What is in this egg? Look, I know I'm used to doing this with like a flame body Pokemon. It doesn't seem close to hatching. <sighs> Ooh, look at that! A Hitmonlee just spawned. That's cool. I know it's all part of this, this event thing, but... Well, you just despawn, but, uh... You saw, you saw, you saw. 
Now, I know that we, we could just go on, but I really, I just wanted to finish the episode with two, two trades. Also, like, I have this Roto Power right now. If I don't use it now, I'm never going to have it because I don't do the Roto stuff in this game. Um... It actually is kind of warm in here. Actually, you know why I think it gets warm so much right here where I'm sitting? Number one, the window behind us, the shades or the blinds are open. Number two, I've got two lamps that are turned on in front of me. Number three, I've got a screen in front of me with a white screen on that is making the lighting the way it is. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe that's what causes it to be so, so warm here after I start recording. Appears to move occasionally. Okay, we're getting closer. We're getting closer. We're gonna run this thing out I don't remember what it is. I remember that it's not good, but that's about all I remember Maybe it's a why not I think it's a why not that's my guess Now why is it randomly a why not? I mean why not? I just looked over and saw the start recording button and I definitely yesterday forgot to record a video like I forgot to hit start recording the first time I think I've ever done that but let's not let that happen 36 minutes into the video come on I'm going crazy thank you Woo! Woo! <laughs> Oh, it's an Eevee. That's why it took so freaking long to hatch. That's why everyone in there was talking about Eevee. I wouldn't mind having an Eevee traded to us. I mean, we would be going for Umbreon, the by far best Eeveelution. Yeah, I said it. By far the best. We actually... We did a our, our playthrough of of Ultra or our playthrough of Ultra Moon featured an Eevee that we evolved into an Umbreon. Jet the Umbreon. Actually, Jet is the whole reason we were able to win. Uh, the whole reason we were able to beat the scary Pokemon towards the end of the game that I still have yet to name. So if you're watching through this game and you did not play through the end, then you will still be surprised because I have yet to say it. That's some self-control I've got. Hey, stop it. I don't know if we're going to hit any more Z moves today. I want to get these two encounters. I want to get some new Pokemon. Alright, now it is the middle of the week, so... Yeah. Everyone gets the same Pokemon. He, he, he's always the exact same. But let's trade him. You know, it shows me that there's a Geodude at this Pokestop. And like, if you look where I am and where the Pokestop is, I'm there. Pokestop is there. All I have to do is walk. Whoa! Hey, stop it. Walk that way. And then I go up. And then I go, oh my god, this is so impossible. And then I go over that way. It's really not that far. I could just walk over there and see if this, uh, see if the Geodude that's going to spawn is shiny. Because I really want a shiny Geodude. We got anything good? Oh, you ain't got anything good? <laughs> we got anything good? It's a fur fro. Wait a second. Why does that look like the Crest of Reliability and the Crest of Hope? That's what I want to know. Alright, what level is this thing? Can I trade it off? I can! What does CHT stand for? What country is CHT? Oh, I'm sorry. You definitely just saw it. I, I was not thinking about that.
CHT. You can't just tell me I have to actually click in. Traditional Chinese. Okay. So it's, it's a traditional Chinese language. That's where this one's from. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Sophie, can you send me something good, please? Something good, please? No? No? You send trash, Sophie? Sophie, why you send trash, Sophie? Sophie, why? Womel? Yeah, that's your, uh, that's this thing's French name, I do believe. Or European name would be the right way to say that. All right, well, we've got ourselves a cutie fly, and I'm going to assume that it's going to be low enough level. Nectar and pollen are its favorite fare in fields of flowers. It gets to, it gets into skirmishes with Butterfree over food. Sure. Sure. Modest nature. That's actually not bad. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. And then we get to train, trade this wanted domino Eevee. Who do you think is the best Eevee Lucian? Let's talk about him. Vaporeon? Eh, bottom tier. Bottom tier of the of the Eevee Lucians. Not my favorite. Jolteon? Nice design. Electric type is cool. I think I have a shiny Jolteon. I think that was one of the few ones that I got. Um, Flareon. Oh, that's dupes. That's so funny. Uh, we got one of these last episode. Anyway. Flareon. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. By any means. Not bad, but... Nothing... Flareon's nothing crazy. Espeon. Extremely overrated. Careful nature. Oh, this one has fake out. Oh... And Intimidate. Can I trade this one? Or can I keep this one? Dupes is just an optional thing. Is that okay? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it. I, I can't like substitute it and trade the other one. But I can, Dupes is optional. You don't have to use Dupes. And if we decide to, then we can always trade it later. Uh, I'm going to quickly... Oh. We can take on these last couple battles. I don't think that'll hurt. That won't hurt anybody. Uh, I'm going to let Muddy do it. Now, this guy here. This guy's pretty funny. I like this guy. He's like... He is... Ooh! Amulet coin. Who am I giving that? Who doesn't have an item? All right, you're gonna get this item. Wait, what? Oh, that's weird. Why was it at the bottom of my list? Should have been at the top. We got our Paniola Ranch encounter and we got our Eevee encounter. This guy's working out. He says fixing a truck. Well, you ain't fixing no truck. You're literally sitting there. You're literally sitting there doing abs, doing sit-ups. Oh, you have a lily pup? Oh, you have a lily pup? Oh, I, I have muddy up. Ooh, if I had pincer, I was about to turn my Z ring back on. I was about to turn my Z ring back on and destroy you. Really? This is what we're doing? This is what we're doing? We're baby doll izing? Oh, and we get a crit. Nice job, muddy. That's how we do things. That's how we do things on this team. Nobody lives. Does Magnemite have Levitate? I feel like Magnemite has Levitate. It does not have Levitate. It has Death. It has Sturdy. Oh. Magnet Bomb. Oh no, don't Magnet Bomb me. No, not Magnet Bomb. Oh no, Magnemite. Why'd you have to Magnet Bomb me? Gone. Dang, that thing fell. He fell. Straight up. 
fell. Gone. Peace. Out of here. I would have won if I didn't lose. Astute deduction. I don't like this. I don't like how they just like quit what they were doing. He had a cool little animation he had. And then it's just over and you can't see it again. That's... I think that's kind of lame. Now, if I remember right, he said a would have seemed kind of down ever since Lana beat them, but they're blocking the path now and no one can go through. Seems like they're so petrified of Lana now that they don't even want to see another Waterium Z after she smacked down, smacked down on them with that water type Z power of hers. So? So? So da wudo? So da wudo? Uh, I think this is the- oh crap. Hold on. Stop everything. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm, I'm not worried about you. If I remember right... Maybe it's not yet. Maybe it's after the next trial. Sableye? Sableye is a ghost... Sableye is ghost dark, meaning he completely walls... My, my scissor. That's lame. That's lame. Lame. Astonish. Oh no! I'm astonished. Hey, in, in place of that astonish, how about you hold this? That didn't... Is he just dark or is he dark ghost? I think he's dark ghost. Actually, hold on. I think he's dark ghost. Nightshade. It's gonna be what, 19? No, 15. That's his level. I keep getting that backwards. Okay, really? Really? Why? Why are you like this? Also, is that a Z-ring on your arm? You wouldn't dare. You would not dare. Oh, so you, another, so you another one with money. Oh, you got money? Oh, you got money. You got money? Alright, as long as he doesn't use Detect, we'll be good. Or get a bunch of crits here. I'm going for it. Cool. I was about to say. Now, at this point, we can't lose a Pokemon. I've talked so much trash that if we lose a Pokemon now... Tell me why. Ain't nothing but a party. Tell me why. Ain't... Anyway. Um... Also, I think the words are, tell me why ain't nothing but a heartache. Uh, and then, tell me why ain't nothing but a mistake. But You'll find Brooklyn Hill at the end of Route 5. That's where Captain Lana does her trial. Well, right here, in between these two little tracks, we're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode. Today's episode was eventful. Start off with a how battle. And then it went to the Paniola Ranch, where we had a very difficult battle against these two luxury trainers, or veteran trainers, or whatever their class is called. Um, and we got ourselves an egg, a couple new encounters, and a nice, a nice litten in the PC. If you enjoyed today's episode, hit the thumbs up down below. Leave me a comment for how long you think we're going to go before we lose a Pokemon. Will we ever lose a Pokemon? I don't know. You'll have to come back to find out. We'll see you next week for more Pokemon Ultra Moon. Until then, have a blessed day.